tax evasion is a big problem in India. Those who can exploit existing loopholes in the tax laws. But India is tightening norms to plug these leakages. One of the common ways to avoid paying the due taxes is through donations made to charitable trusts. And tax authorities suspect that large tax evasion takes place using this particular loophole. And so the Central Board of Direct Taxes has decided to ask for additional disclosures for donations made to such entities. In April this year, 8,000 taxpayers who claim to have donated significant amounts with charitable trusts were sent notices because data analytics showed that these taxpayers were making disproportionate to their income donations to such trusts. The notices were sent to salaried employees, self-employed individuals and companies. To further discourage individuals from exploiting this loophole, the Income Tax Department is also investigating chartered accountants and other tax professionals who facilitated these transactions. Donations made to charitable institutions are exempted under ATG. In 2021-22, companies claim a tax exemption of 1430 crores under Section ATG. Individuals and Hindu United families claim to be 1729 crores under Section ATG. Under the new rules, charitable trusts will now be required to disclose donor information, names, addresses, and permanent account numbers of donors who donate more than Rs 2 lakhs in a day will now be made mandatory. Charitable trusts will also have to submit undertaking affirming that activities undertaken by them are of a charitable, religious, or religious come charitable nature. The revised format for undertaking will be effective from October 1st. Just two months ago, the government introduced changes to the registration framework for charitable organizations, specifically for claiming tax exemption or obtaining an ATG certificate under the Income Tax Act. Now, as per the latest rules, newly established trusts or institutions must apply for provisional registration at least one month prior to the start of the financial year for which registration is sought. Furthermore, the department is now actively monitoring charitable trusts suspected of issuing fake bills to taxpayers. Although no action has been taken against them so far, they risk losing their tax exemption status if any wrongdoing is established.